What's up, my bitter brothers, beauty maniac here with NBA game picks. Figured I had to mute the song, so I went in here to see with game picks, and obviously there's only five choices to choose from, so I'm gonna have to go off my phone as well, but at least highlight these five games. First game we got is Bucks Hornets, not on here currently, but I'm gonna pick the Bucks in this one. I like I like Giannis. I think he's going to be playing well. I think he starts the season strong. Maybe wins MVP this year. Who knows? The spread is Milwaukee favored by three. I think they should cover. Then you got Nets Pistons. Pistons favored by six. I would not be surprised if the Nets won this one. They got some nice young talent. But I'm going to pick the Pistons to win and cover the spread. Mainly because they're at home. And home teams in the NBA tend to play better. In front of their home fans. Then you got Grizzlies Pacers. Pacers by 7.5. They should win and cover. Heat Magic. Heat favored by 2.5. I think the Heat win and cover this one as well. The Magic have a lot of big men talent. But the front court is weak. And the Heat should be able to expose it. Then you have the Hawks. The Knicks. Trey Young's debut. How will he do? Uh, this one's tough. This one's tough for sure. The Knicks are favored by three and a half in this one. And if I click on the game, for injuries, it says... You know what? I'm going to pick the Knicks. I like Porzingis. I like Courtney Lee. Hopefully something happens. Hopefully it's good basketball. I wish Trey Young the best of luck here in his debut. And then you get the Cavs, the Raptors. I'm going to the Raptors with this one favored by 12 and a half. I don't think they cover. I think they win, but if you're going against the spread, I'd pick the Cavs to at least cover the spread. And Pelicans, Rockets, I'm picking the Rockets. This one's on at ESPN at 8 p.m. Eastern Time, 5 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Central if you are a Rockets fan in Houston. They're favored by 8. I'm going to pick the Houston Rockets to win just because I think their front court or their, their guard tandem, I should say, is incredible and with the Pelicans mainly just having Drew Holiday I think the Rockets exploit them at that position Anthony Davis should be able to go off and if, if the Pelicans win I'm gonna say it's because of Anthony Davis obviously but he'll have to have a big game I'm saying like 35 points 15 rebounds four blocks or something like that and you got Timberwolves Spurs as you can see it's the only one I have picked yet here San Antonio is favored by two and a half and you want to I'm going to pick it. I'm going to submit. Boom. Choose your game. There we go. Uh, Greg Popovich coaching at home in the season opener. I think he'll have an advantage. He's had all off season to prepare for this. And I think DeRozan should have a decent amount of success in San Antonio. And you have the Jazz Kings. Jazz favored by 8.5. I think they win and cover as well. Mavericks Suns. Mavericks favored by 1.5 here. This game's on ESPN at 10.30 p.m. Eastern. 7.30 p.m. Pacific time. And with Mavericks favored by one and a half, it's basically a gimme. Or by that, why that I mean a 50-50 split. I'm gonna go with... These two teams are hard to pick last year. They don't, Every time I picked them, they'd always lose. So I'm gonna go with the Suns. I think Booker's gonna go off. I think Booker's gonna have a great game. And I'm gonna go with the upset. Even though it's not much of an upset, but still. And at 10.30 p.m. East, Eastern Time, 7.30 p.m. Pacific, we have the Nuggets at the Clippers. The game that should have been on ESPN. But I guess everyone wanted to see Don, Te Don Cheech versus Bagley. But okay, I'd rather see the Nuggets. Nuggets hosting the uh, Nuggets traveling to L.A. to take on the Clippers. They have one and a half. I think they win and cover. Hopefully, IT can be a good utility player for Denver. And get back into rhythm. Anyway guys thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.